tries to get it a second time, but again he's beaten to it uh, by uh, Jack Sporer in this field. He picks it up though, and uh, Adam O'Reilly in a good chance for shooting position, but he hits the bar! Well, Dermot, after Magpies enjoying a lot of possession, Gary has to... So this could go short, there's two men in the Magpies wall, catching the disarm there, so the wind straight, and then the toss, right on top of the keeper, oh, and it just goes past. Um, I'll leave this to you, Dermot, do you think he was going for it all? Um, he's got this coming, previously played with Glenn Torrance, at two seasons of Glenn Torrance, played 50 times in time, so that gives me an indication of how good a keeper he is. Gallows beaten in the air, uh, and the ball breaks now for the uh, Dodgers branch. Gancha in midfield now towards uh, the number nine. It's going to have a shot, and Brian Moore just parries it around. But certainly that shot uh, that came in from Jack Storer, uh, the new signing. But his pass is well intercepted by Kaninga, having a bit of a roy in midfield there. Hooven looks at the ball, picked up by a former Dundalk teammate, Daniel Kelly. It's a chance to run, comes up to the edge of the box. Uh, ball breaks for Kelly inside the box, and there he goes, and he scores, and it's taken off the line. I think Colling may have got a touch there, Dermot, uh, yeah. and just stopped it going in. But I it across to Ash Taylor. Taylor uh, in midfield, and that's well played by Storer. Uh, but his pass breaks down. Jersey looks around. Uh, they don't get it. Storer had a shot a moment ago. Go, uh, goes again at the edge of the box. Plays across now to Bayer. Bayer has a chance, has a shot, and it's deflected. And it's out for the first corner of the game, a uh, second corner of the game and the first corner for Magpies. So referee Jenkins is just uh, checking that everything is up and ready to go and with a swirl whistle, uh, uh, Ben Doherty sees that goes over the head, plays up the line to McMullen. A terrible pass by McMullen, right to the edge of the box and a shot just over the bar. But that was a shocking pass by Paul McMullen. Um, you were back in and uh, under pressure again and Hoopin stays on there to defend as well so Garcia again, uh, Ganche is looking uh, short for it but Alan O'Reilly is watching that so it goes into the box and it's dangerous and it's a and it's a goal for Magpies coming in at the back post Ash Taylor, it's all gone wrong for Gary City, three minutes in Patrick standing over the suspend Doherty so uh, the passing rights would have Doherty left and it's bending and takes and it's passing that's uh, easily headed out by the goal scorer, but it drops it there. And a swinging shot from Daniel Kelly just go past Colling. A decent repost by Derry City. Magpies just on their uh, right hand side. And that's going to be taken by Kevin Ronco. Ronco's throw, however, bounces off uh, Darley's chest. Picked up, however, by uh, Biote. Well played in midfield now by Sally. And a played it long. We're all looking for a flag. It's not given. Story comes in. Comes into the box. Has a chance here to shoot. Has a shoot. Deflects. Deflects back to him. Derry City managed to clear it. And uh, Derry City, however, looking for the ball in midfield. It breaks now for Gancha. Gancha at the edge of the box. He's got Zuninga outside him. The right full back. Left full back. Back now with Gancha. I have to say, Story looked off side to me, but uh, the Welsh uh, assistant referee didn't give it. Back now with Taylor, the goal scorer. He plays across to Ruben Diaz. Stays into Derry City territory. Plays it low, but the attempted pass around the side doesn't work out. But uh, the ball out from Connolly isn't great. And Derry City lose possession again. Drops again, and it's spun out now towards the dangerous left winger, Gancha. Gancha has a nuka behind him, but tries to come in field. Plays it towards Story, just inside the box. Connolly should see that ball out and does. And gets a free kick, actually, rather. It's played long. Very silly looking again for an offside, which isn't given. Uh, and Marr has to be alert. Paul McMullen has a bit of grass or plastic grass in front of him. Has a chance to run. Goes in field now to Adam O'Reilly in the centre circle and further out to uh, Dummigan. Dummigan across to Kelly. Dummigan again. A uh, little flick round the corner towards Kelly. Kelly has a chance now to come up towards the edge. Face it towards Patrick. Could Patrick get a, pa a shot away? Oh, lovely play. Kelly, oh, he comes in and it just goes past the post. But that was glorious play by Will Patrick. What a lovely piece of play and a great... And, ...and stuff in the pitches are great, but we've got to get a grip in this midfield. And just, uh, I mean, maybe get uh, Polly Whelan on or Mullen and, and just go two up top. And, um, I mean... We, we haven't really penetrated since well, we've got on both. I think Kelly, Daniel Kelly should score when he's side foot yeah. supplied. But um, 
you know, more of that. You know, and it was a lovely play from Patchett, but we're quite happy to move it around, but far too slow, Michael. It needs to be quicker. It needs to be much, much quicker, actually. My, uh, Shane Michael only has it, plays it to Connolly. Michael Duffy pulls off on the left hand flank, uh, which leaves space for Ben Doherty, who has it now. Doherty back to Michael Henning, Adam O'Reilly looks for it. He's now going to be uh, close out by Garcia, but he's played out towards Cameron Dunningham on the right hand side. Michael Henning has Patsy in front of him, uh, plays it down, he's close out by Christian Valley, the uh, second half substitute, so his leg should be okay. Conley across to McMullen. McMullen has been in space here. He's got Garcia in front of him. Plays a good ball in towards Daniel Kelly. Kelly gets his cross in and Pulling just gets it. And uh, but that was a good pick out from Paul McMullen. Yeah, good play for Paul McMullen. Play. Only I think he's been no, the I've best there, both defensively and goal. I've and just seen it on the replay. It's not a free kick. It's, it's not just a free it's kick. It's, it's absolutely really not. not. It's absolutely not. You're right. So anyway, the free kick is not going to be taken by uh, Garcia. Oh, it's a good one. And it's a second goal for Magpies. Uh, coming in is their captain, Zaniga, unmarked. Derry City cannot. There's a lack of something. I don't know what it is, but uh, this, this has been a poor European performance all round for Derry. The ball breaks now for Bayona. Bayona with the shot. It's a good one. It's parried by uh, Mar. Uh, Sally, I think, fouls uh, Mark Connolly. And Dawson now brings it out. But yet again, we had a Magpies player. 20